Hi everyone. So today I am here to discuss a very important topic, and that is video, right? It's a very crucial uh, because when we are talk about um, video in website, it can be any website. The main thing is coming up is loading time and also buffering time to use high quality video. Suppose this video is more than one five uh, one five zero like one fifty megabyte, and its uh, uh, duration around uh, twenty second, and its high quality video, and it's actually showing the original quality here without buffering and any loading, and that is possible because we actually tweak that in a different strategy and that's what i'm going to break down today so this video coming very fast like when i load this website this coming like an image like when I, we load a website the image coming up within a second but in case of video it's really not possible but that we achieved here it's coming very fast if i load this again see it's coming something like this and that's the feature we want to add on our website and this method will help you to stylize your design like uh, you can style your designs that way I did so this video you can see this is the original video and there are some lag you will see right see there are some laggings but this is the same video same everything but there is no lags you can see it's moving smoothly i maybe i cannot share uh, i cannot show the original one because i am recording this it may lose some quality but this there is no difference in quality but this one has some lagging issue you can see but this is uh, this one is really super smooth and that's our goal uh, today and that's our today's goal and that's what i'm going to show you third one also see you can also add your imagination and creativity here something like this and the main thing is this all video are highest quality right and we are not relying on framer at this moment because we have the full liberty to use the file sizes we want the highest quality we want we can also do that and that's the reason for this video i'm uh, here to break down and that's it and it's very very important to understand the basic because I know as I am a developer and a product designer I know most of the people face issues on this video because they want to show the highest quality of video that they produced but when they upload that on their website it's getting laggy and buffered and that's the reason uh, people uh, try to solve this in an advanced way and that's that's possible as you can see on my screen this video has some uh, stylized over it like there are some uh, section I added advanced shape and that is uh, achievable because I used that strategy if I don't use that if I use uh, existed framer uploaded limitation uh, less than 20 megabyte I could do that but if I did the file uh, the video quality will not be the same as it is you can see now and that is the reason i thought why not break down this so you all can get benefited from here this video can be longer not more than 10 minutes but if you spend 10 minutes here today i think your all questions about video will be solved and that's why i am creating this video and it's really possible the second one this one you can see this is also possible you can say hey this is possible in framer as well it's not new but it's new it's not new but it's advanced strategy i applied this video is uh, containing highest quality of video that has mo more than uh, around uh, 60 megabyte and this is showing the highest quality not the not the like lowest and this is possible and the reason behind this i am showing you you could say we can use third party hosting server like video hosting server to sh uh, sh uh, show something like this but man i tried a lot 
and that third party hosting platform will uh, take a bit time to load and also has some buffer issue if you are going to use the free plan and also the paid plan and that's the really hectic things i faced and based on my experience i am sharing this and yeah this one as well uh you can see i applied some uh, you can also apply this on your style or your design or, or on your each element or any container something like this you can change its shapes you can also play around using you can also apply scroll snap or scroll speed or anything like scroll trans uh, scrolls transformation or using variant everything is possible because there is there is no player button here right and that's the reason uh, it will look something like this uh, like an image but it's moving something like that using highest quality of video and that's the motive and that's the reason i am sharing this yeah if you want to use highest quality of video we can use that and that's the old traditional way like this one and if you want to use something like this uh, from hosting I, I i found out some uh, I, I i saw many website using such a strategy but you see this is a youtube video and it looks something very bad and i think you should not follow that strategy rather than use that so i hope you understand like what's the purposes of this uh, uh breakdown like how you can utilize your video in different way and use your creativity there and this will also contains lowest amount of file sizes that will uh, increase your website health and that's also very important to keep that keep in mind and it's designer friendly and design friendly that is why you can you can use it anywhere you want and if you want to apply players like player functioning things you can also do that that's what i'm going to share today so yeah our strategy will be something like this so the strategy here is so this is our website and this one is our video right we are not uh, hosting this uh, video from our server we are not doing that we are using third party hosting platforms not like others as i mentioned before this is not the same as it was it's a bit different and that's that's the thing i'm going to break down and this one is framer or webflow database and if we can do that they may allow us 20 megabyte or more than that in webflow but that's that's not the thing we're going to apply today and this is not also a professional way to handle this we will handle this in a professional way and that's the thing is we are going to use this tool and it's called cloud dinary and if i spell that i will provide that link below so you can sign up and use that you just need to, after signing up you will see this type of dashboard you just need to go to media explorer and upload your video and once you uploaded that like this video is already completed uh, uploading uh, procedure and if i double click on it this video has three phases see managed and analyzed there are some data here you don't need to worry for that at this moment it's 5.58 uh, megabyte and this one is already consumed this data and string that and this is the original video link you can copy that also that is optimized and delivered this is what we are going to use on our website if i click that and copy it this will automatically optimize your video if i click on it and if i go to our website we just need to add our uh, video the existed video component you just need to paste that here that's it this is how it simple it is and there are much more uh, it's as it's a existed component in framer you can change all the functionalities here like playing or using any thumbnail as well uh, to start point and end point also looping everything you can change that for that you just need to create it uh, convert this as a stack or frame like i'm converting it as a stack and make it fit for each content 
now i can convert this as a component right if i convert this as a component now i can apply much more functionalities here like for the primary one it will be simple as it is but the, for the variant two if i want to make it playable let's make it playable uh, click on on the video and enable the playing yes or no i am going to use uh, yes or no options muted or not like i want to make it sound when someone click on this uh the, suppose there is a mic icon here i am using uh absolute for this like suppose this one is our mic icon so this video the first one the primary one will not uh, contain sound but i am attaching this mic icon so this one the second variant will contain its sound like it's not muted at this moment so we can increase the sound and volume everything and then i just need to tweak that to our second options like something like this so when someone click on this mic icon the sound will automatically start also you can if you want to add pause icon or play icon you can also do that like uh, this suppose this one is our pause icon and let's delete the variant connections let's create another variant for this this one is our variant tree we can now make it a uh, pause like playing no so if i link that with our interaction go to our interaction and click on variant it will automatically stop even when i click on it right so this is how you can also add your functionalities here all the creativity if you want to add that is possible and that's what i did like for the this one with this video i applied the video inside it and manipulate that something like this and the second video this one i really like this type of video and this one is containing something like uh, the video itself and there is nothing in it really simple but looks really nice you can also add your scroll trigger here to make it more smooth and everything if you want and that and i hope you understand the reason i am behind this for this breakdown and if you really like this that will be a lot for me and i really appreciate if you have any questions you can comment me down i'll do my best to assist there and that's it and this was a rush video i had a very little time to do that and that is why my uh, so that is why i tried i i was in rush in talk and i'm really sorry for that and yeah that's it have a good time see you soon